Either of you fools even have a car? <laughs> I, uh, I sort of it lost it. mine. It's a, so it's a long story. Seriously? There are cars in the back. Clients who never paid. I'm surrounded by... Alright guys, welcome back to Need for Speed Payback. We're choosing our first car. Buick GNX. Now there's a badass car. This one can still pull a six second zero to 60 after 30 years. All right, so we've got a 1987 Buick Grand National. The Mark I Golf GTI, the car that launched the hot hatch trend. Still an ass kicker to this day. 1976 Volkswagen Golf, or I see the next one back there in the background, that S2000, S2000 baby. S2000 Honda's homage to the roadsters of the 60s. Push that VTEC engine to 9,000 RPM to see what she can really do. And that's going to be all we have. We are most definitely going to be going with the S2000. I love these things. Do we want to select this car? Absolutely. She's ours, boys. Let's go. Good choice. Nothing compared to my rides, but it'll do. I thought all you did was tune them up. All right, you just earned yourself an ass kicking. It's time to race, baby. Not bad. Let's see if it's enough to keep you in the lead. Yeah, we're kind of struggling on the speed front compared to some of the other vehicles we've been in, but that's all right. We want to finish this race and hopefully be able to finish it in first. We'll see. We do have some nitrous in it. Oh, gosh. I thought we were taking it right there. Right in the middle left. Come on, baby. <laughs> He's roasting me. All right, here we go, boys. Six months, Tyler. What were you doing out there? That was the deal. Work for the gambler or go to jail. What's the deal now? He had plans for me, but I convinced him mine were better. So here we are. Tyler, you know I'm done with that life. We had a good run, but I'm a mechanic. I've got a good thing going out here. She double crossed this way. You don't want to see her stopped? Man, I'd still give anything to see what's under the hood of that gun exec. But I'm done being angry. I found my feet. Well, I'm happy for you, I guess. Where did he even go? Is he off-roading right now? I haven't seen him in a while. You're not holding back, are you? Please don't hold back. Oh, I won't. Woo! Dude, the drifting in this game is actually really, really fun. This won't end with the barrel, right? You know who she works for, what she represents. No one has ever gone up against a house and won. You know that. First time for everything. 500 yards remaining. He's gonna come out of nowhere off this jump. I guarantee it. Is back to the garage with you. Maybe not. We just straight up beat him. I'll take it. Wins over raw power. Good stuff, baby. 7K. In the bank. Speed cards. Speed cards improve car performance. Earn speed cards by winning events. Got it. Draw a speed card. Um, which one's speaking to me? The left one. Okay. Braking power, brake response. A little bit of improvement to our horsepower, top speed, etc. Hey, Matt, where'd you two disappear to? Rav didn't have what I needed. We're off to the dealership to find me some off-road wheels. Word. Oh yeah. You good for this? I can lend you some money. Nah, sis, I'm good. I pulled out my savings. <laughs> All right, Mac. I see you out here. We're gonna be able to choose. Oh, we're gonna choose his car as well. Whoo, dealerships. Each dealership specializes in different build type. There are five build types to discover. Race, drift, off-road, drag, and runner. Got it. Off-road build. Use this build for off-road events. These cars and trucks specialize in off-road control and jumps. Which one Dude. Are you for, Mac? So we can go for the Defender or the WRX STI. A hatch of choice for a bounce around the scenery. Great grip and handling. But my ass is going to remember every bump. The Land Rover 110. Whew. They haven't changed the shape for decades, and for good reason. This thing can take some serious punishment. This thing is so sexy, but I just don't... 
I don't know, man. I don't see it. It's actually pretty similar. I mean, this thing is incredibly sexy. Part of me really wants to go for the Impreza just because I, I love Subis. But this thing is dope, dude. I think I'm going to go... Just to mix it up, because normally I would pick the Subaru, I'm going to go with the Defender. All right. We got it, boys. We're going to pick two new cars. This is awesome. Ouch. It's okay, baby. She didn't mean it. Now, I have to kick your ass. Race to the airfield. All right. Here we go, baby. Dude, this thing is bad to the bone, bro. It's all blacked out and everything. I mean, oh man, I don't know. That that was a tough decision. I just feel like normally I would have chosen the Subaru, so I wanted to mix it up. Woo. Okay. Why are you really doing this, Max? What do you mean? We get a mega payoff and get to kick Navarro's ass. What's not to like? I know you, Max. It's not that simple. Ties on a personal crusade, but that's not you. Straight talk, Jess. After we split, I had nothing. Doing odd jobs for cash. And sometimes, that meant the house. You took a gamble and lost. You did what you had to do. But coming to America's been one big wager. Besides, it's not gambling if you know you're gonna win. You got your own thing, Jess. You don't need us. Why are you in? Someone's gotta watch out for Ty. Taking on the street leads to get into an impossible race? He's angry and fixated on Navarro, and he's going to meet us. So you think we got a chance? After it all went down, we didn't hear from him for six months. If he's back, he believes he can win. And I'm not letting a brother go to war alone. Ha! I knew it! You missed us! Look, Matt, I'll support you guys as long as you're not idiots. I'm in it for you two, not thrilled. I know you, Jess. You won't be able to help yourself. I mean, this thing's actually pretty quick. It was, we, I mean, we were hitting a buck, buck 30. Heck yeah, baby. All right, 7,000 for race wins, I'll take it. What's R? All right, we went left last time, it didn't really work out, so left's gotta work this time. Nitrous, we got ahead, baby, look at that. Managing speed cards, there are many ways to use your speed cards, equip, sell, trade in, and send a garage. Send this card to Rav in the garage. I kind of want to equip it, but I guess we got to send it to our garage. Sweet, baby. So speed cards are the way that you you kind of rank up and level up your vehicles. I'll admit, I didn't Tune your vehicle at all. Ha, you don't win anything by playing safe. Point taken, but I'll stick to the roads. Thank you very much. All right. We're gonna head on over to the garage. Look at all these sweet hey, jumps, man. boy. Nice ride you got there, Max. Why don't you bring her around to the garage? Be right there. Didn't have enough speed there. <laughs> Dude, these are insane, though. Look at all these. These are like legitimate skateboard ramps out here. All right, this thing is low-key a little bit hard to control. That Impreza would have been dope, dude. Well, I mean, we're obviously, we're not gonna stick with our main off-roading car for too long, though. We're gonna be buying new vehicles, hitting the dealerships all the time, having a good time. I've cleared up this space for you three. Feel free to leave your cars here, tune them up, paint them, work on your style. Why don't you try a bit of upgrading first? See if you can get some extra performance out of those cars. I have a few parts lying around the shop. Just put everything back where you found it. Understood? Okay. Performance customization. Choose your offer cards. Select performance customization and equip heads. Speed card. Okay. So we'll select this. Performance customization. We've got our head speed card. Congratulations on upgrading your car. Choose the help button to learn more about performance customization. Feel free to explore the rest of the garage. All right. I kind of want to... Dude, we could have up to 10 cars. That's pretty crazy. I kind of want to take... This is where the magic happens. The more you do out there, the more you can get in here to make your ride sing. Style is expression. What do you want to say with your car? 
So we can't change anything yet. It looks like it's based off of challenges, like, you know, hit, hit two jumps or whatever. I kind of want to take the heads off. And I want to put the heads on our S2000. So I'm going to select this car. Performance customization. Oh, the other one was an off-roading head, so I can't even really change it. Okay, that makes sense. Paint and wrap. Make a ride, stand out on the road. Go to edit wrap, choose paint color and apply details. Okay. Library, edit wrap. Let's check a library. No custom wraps, create a wrap. Hit back and go to the edit menu. So we could do that. I think, honestly, we may have an episode where we just focus on, on customization. Um... But for now, I want to I want to get back uh, get back into the story. So I'm gonna put the the header or whatever back on here. Performance customization head. Boom. Got some extra nitrous in there. I'm gonna go back at our S2000. Select it. And then we're gonna leave the garage. There we go. But yeah, we're for sure, especially after we buy some what do you got, Rav? some cars that we really want. Worth your time out here in the desert. This one is a racing league called the Graveyard Shift, led by La Katrina. Bunch of kids with a death wish and a taste for the dramatic. Mac, second league's for you. League 73, an off-road crew led by some bastard named Udo. Lately, they've taken to racing around the airfield and smashing up my prototypes. All right. Sounds good to me. But yeah, after we, we start buying some cars and really getting the stuff we want, we're going to do tons of customization. Should start earning us the rep we need to enter the Outlaws Rush. All right, baby. Let's get that rep. So we're going to head on over to our objective, which is going to be the graveyard shift. 1.83 miles. Can we just cut through the desert? I know this is... Let's go find the graveyard shift and challenge them to a race. I know this is an open world game. I don't know if you can straight cut across stuff like... Horizon, though. You might be able to. Alright. Looks like you can! Speed racers, this is your curator. The streets whisper of opportunity and danger. Two nights ago, an unknown racer took first place in the Boonville race. Rumor has it that's not the outcome some people wanted. And a local racer codenamed King Snake ended the night race into the hospital in an ambulance. Oh, wow. And the winner, the streets say to you, ride free, ride proud, and check your blind spots. <laughs> Guess there's no going back now. Supposed to be going to graveyard shift, right? Yeah. The GPS keeps telling me to turn around, but bro, it's literally right in front of me. Ooh, what was that over there? There's something to pick up. We definitely do have to check out the various roads and stuff too. Hit all the speed traps. What is that? Chips. Okay, so that's just kind of like little hidden things that you want to find around the map. I could dig it. Rocks out here chipping my paint, man. I don't like it. All right. La Katrina runs the graveyard shift to street racing league with an obsession with the macabre. Prove yourself in their midnight race and earn La Katrina's respect. Ooh, the OG skyline. Okay. Fly down the highway at a hundred miles an hour. Every decision is life and death. I am La Catrina, and this is the graveyard shift. We've got that Datsun 240 as well. What happened to ours? It's like it we like traded it out for that BMW. Then we had the BMW stolen. It's no good. You the gringo who wants to join our midnight run? Join, beat, same difference. Name's Tyler Morgan. Morgan, huh? <laughs> Never heard of you. Try to keep up with us. I'll do way more than that. 
All right, guys, here we go. How about we make a little extra money on the side? I'll tell you the bet I have in mind, and if you like the odds... I got you. Stay in first for at least 30 seconds. Time to dance with death. Time to win this. Let's get it popping, baby. Hopefully we can keep up. This S2000 looks like we might be able to. We've got our side bet over on the right side. We also, it looks like we've got the Rad Rides time on this, this race, so we're gonna try to beat that as well. We'll see if we can. Woo. Yeah, we only need seven more seconds in first and we're gonna be good to go. Side bet of cheats. Let's try to whip the tail out on that one a little bit more. It didn't really whip it. Whip it real good. Nice. Dude, I think we're gonna have to up the difficulty. I don't know. These first couple episodes, like, we've had a couple of races that are complete blowouts, not even close. And then a couple of races that were very, very close, that we almost lost. So I... I don't know. It's got, like, a weird, weird feel to it. We beat Brad! Let's go, baby! Beat him by a couple of seconds. I like the slow-mo with the cool music at the end after every race. That's good stuff. All right, we got an additional $2,800 for the side bet. Then we're going to have 7000 for winning the race. Made a cool 10 k right there. Shoot. Right. New headers, baby. New head, engine head. Let's go. We're going to go and equip that. New mission unlocked. So it looks like we're gonna have to do five races and then ooh, find gas stations to unlock fast Wait, travel points. Morgan. I have heard of you. You got taken out a few months back. That was then. And what is now, Way? Beat your racers for one, then beat you. Lo siento, Way. You have no chance. We'll see about that. So I can drive through for full nitrous and repair. Nice, that's good stuff. So we need to win five more races to be able to prove ourselves here, I guess. Got everybody hanging out after the race, it's kind of cool. Okay, so we've got Noche de Muertos, 2.6 miles away. Let's, um, let's go do it. Also, it looked like you could go to tune-up shops to be able to buy speed cards. So it's not only about winning races, so that's good. Start saving up our money, be able to buy new cars, and then also be able to buy speed cards for them. Okay. Well, I was not expecting to fall off a cliff right there. Anyway, guys, I'm going to head on over to Noche de Muertos. I'll see you guys there. Looks like they all beat us here. Here we go, boys. Every event has a recommended performance level. Compare your car to the event's level and see how you match up. So our car is a 139. This race is a 140. That's close enough. Works for me. I'm cool with it. Let's run it, boys. Finish the event within 140 seconds and win the race. I'm in. So I have to put money up. My crew, bueno. Wasn't too hard the last time. Orale. <laughs> I gotta put money up on these bets. Let's do this. If I want to win them, you know what I mean. Like I, I gotta bet. So if I if I lose it, I've actually lost money overall. Gotta yeah, dude. To We're a hundred percent. Hold on. Uh, game. Game mode. Event driving. Is there a difficulty? 
You might have to change the difficulty outside of races. We, I mean, we, we shouldn't be able to get the whole shot like that and then just straight up win the race. I want to at least work for it a little bit. What? My headset's a little bit loud. Holy cow. I just realized that I've been playing with a really, really loud. It's like the engine's screaming in my ears. That VTEC power. There's a racer behind us getting chased by the cops. In on the wrong side, but that's fine. Just gonna big drift through here. Woo! Dude, the drifting in this game is so smooth. It's unrealistic, but it's really smooth. It's fun. I'm excited to unlock drift events. It looks like we were able to take out Brad by quite a lot there. That was like 15 seconds. And we hit our objective. We got everything, baby. Won our side bet. Let's go, boys. Another 10K in the bank. The money's starting to pile up pretty quickly. Look at that. We're already at 37.3. We're going to be able to buy some nice cars here pretty soon. I wonder what a GTR costs. I'm going to go for the middle card here brakes boo wait turbo how I don't understand what this it gives me a new turbo oh but it it's a new turbo but it's got the brakes ability on it that's kind of weird we're gonna have hella good brakes on this this s2000 that's for sure all right what do you guys say you gotta wanna wanna do one more I wanted a base ship. She thinks she can rig races in Fortune Valley. I unrig one for her. You guys want to do one more race here? Let's also hold on. Settings. Game difficulty, hard. So there's easy, medium, and hard. I figured medium would be good. But honestly, medium was, was pretty easy. All right. One more race for the boys. Here we go. So we're going to be on hard difficulty, and we're going to be racing six levels under the recommended. La Katrina's begun to notice the fire that fuels her quest to get back into Navarro. Show her some of that passion by beating her crew. In a mountain race. All right, guys, we're gonna give it a go. Drift for 1,093 yards and win the race. I'll take it. Morgan here thinks he's back in the game, y'all. How about we give that new confidence a proper burial? You're welcome to try. Let's see what we can do here, boys. All right, I'm gonna use my nitrous right off the bat. Let's try to get into a good spot. Oh man, I can already tell the difference with the hard difficulty. We're gonna be okay. We just gotta make sure we're always using our nitrous. I'm gonna get in the opposite lane. Come on, bro. Okay, keep going. We're fine. I thought that said Mad Lad in front of us. It's Mall Dad. Dang it, I'm a little bit dis... <laughs> if it would have been Mad Lad, that would have been really funny. Dude, these guys are inherently faster than our car. Just keep the line. 
That's from the um, the level difference, though. That's not from the the difficulty. Uh, it's probably a combination of both, but. First, we need 70 more yards of drifting, which I think is going to be fine here. Six more yards of drifting. We got it. Now we just got to hold first place, baby. Gotta keep it up. So I definitely think drifting adds to your nitrous. I think it helps you refuel quicker. Could have sworn I heard these guys behind me. Dude, that was some white knuckle driving. I was honestly a little bit worried about that. Holy cow, we beat Brad by 20 seconds there. We're getting faster and faster against Brad. He's the man. Anyway, guys, whew, hit all of our objectives, doubled our side bet, got the win. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna go for the middle again. Exhaust with a speed boost. That's what I like to see. All right. We've got two races left with this group, but uh, we're going to take those on in the next episode.